and uh, I'm standing with Pastor Frank here, and we are uh, at the back of his auditorium right now, and actually where we are standing uh, was an old chicken coop, and uh, the church has come in, and they've cleaned it up, and put bamboo, split bamboo, and put it around the building, and, and uh, they come here every week, and they worship the Lord, and they learn teaching from the Bible from Pastor Frank, and, and he's just doing a tremendous job. I've had the opportunity to spend some time with him in fellowship and get to know him a little bit. Uh, in 2007, I believe it, you got saved in 2007, what, what, uh, didn't you? Yeah. From a missionary from America, uh, from the team that came down here, from, uh, came to Ghana, and so he trusted Christ, came to church, and I asked him, I said, when did you uh, start coming to church? And he says, as soon as I got saved. And I said, when did you join Bible college? He says, as soon as I got saved, man, and he just, he just went right to it, and that was exciting, and Joined, uh, became in the Bible Institute, which turned into the Bible College, and he graduated from Bible College in 2012. From there, he went right out and helped a sister church that was sent from that uh, church in college, and he helped them for a year. And now he's been here uh, for about a year as well, haven't you? And he's just doing a tremendous job. We've seen people out, and as I get to know some of these men and enjoy seeing some of their church people that uh, they're working with and discipling and. And they've got a great opportunity here, the property, they have land, they have uh, different things that God has given them and just really blessing them. So I wanted you to meet Pastor Frank. And Pastor, why don't you just take a few minutes to kind of tell us maybe a little bit about your, your village, your community, maybe some of the plans that you have for, for God to do through your ministry here. This is Kunsu. It is a village and the population is very wide. And this place is full of churches. But the churches are not preaching the true gospel. They are not preaching the gospel that I heard and I got saved. That they are not preaching that gospel. And this place is full of different churches, but they are not preaching this gospel. So my aim and my goal in this community is to train people. And also these people were, um, were able to get the, the message I preach them and I disciple them and I help them to um, also I build a churches that can help the community to know the true gospel that I heard of and I got saved. So right now I've started a Bible training class that I'm teaching this and so every Thursday I teach this class and the people are responding and I believe by training them the discipleship also will grow, and by the grace of God, I think we, are, we will be able to reach the whole community. And after then, our, my vision is to start building churches across the village of Kunsu. Pastor Frank was just telling me that uh, he's, he's, a, he's a manufacturer of windows and doors and different things like that, and just about a month ago, he quit that job to spend more time focusing on the church, and that's a sign of commitment. And so I, I hope as a ministry that we can get behind Pastor Frank and Brother Ted and the church there in Kumasi and partner with them financially to help this ministry and help this church. I wish, I, I hope that you would pray that, that if it's God's will, you get behind this ministry. 